with uh, Thanksgiving happening the other day, um, I hope we didn't lose sight of Transgender Day of Remembrance. Oh, good call. Yeah, because that was a big day for all of us, I think. Uh, White House spokesperson KJP made sure we remembered about Transgender Day of Remembrance. Well, today, on Transgender Day of Remembrance, yeah. we grieve the 26 really? transgender Americans 26. who were killed this year. Uh-oh. Year after year, 26. we see that these victims mm. are disproportionately black women uh-huh. and women of color. What? No one should face violence, what? live in fear, or be discriminated against simply for being themselves. Okay, got All that? Right. Well, good. Because, I mean, good. Because. Uh, 26, how many heterosexual people were killed last year? Right, right. She <laughs> is it anywhere close to 26? You see what she's insinuating oh, there is that gosh. straight normies are out there just... Just massacring yeah, transgender it's people. It's gotta stop. It uh, does. It does have to stop. But do we know the stats on that? Because yeah, we do actually. I've seen the BS yeah, we do on actually. this before. Yeah. Um, um, and, and when is trans, when is heterosexual... Uh, normal person remembrance day. How many, I wonder how many heterosexual people Mm -hmm. who haven't changed genders died last year. I'm going to look at those numbers. Well, of the 26. It's got to be in the tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands. Um, 12 12 of the uh, 26 transgenders that KJP (sighs) was speaking of were murdered by their, um, like, domestic partner. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, 12? Okay. Yeah. Uh, two, so now we're down to 14. Uh-huh. Two were shot by security guards during a robbery. Oh, okay. Now we're down uh, to 10. One was killed by uh, an environmental protest by state troopers. Nine. Uh, um, I got to find the rest of these, but it's like it's stuff like that. You know? Yeah. It's just oh, like, my gosh. Like they're trying to make it sound like exactly. all 26 Because that's what were this, hate crimes. That's what this administration does, right? I, I can't. I just... Uh, ah! Um, oh, oh, look at this. Uh, po- let's see. One, let's see. Wellness check. Uh, oh, gosh. Here we go. Listen to this. And I mean, I don't want them killed by anybody. Right. None of us do. But don't make it sound like mm-hmm. they're being stalked and hunted by the rest of us because they're not. That's not happening. So one of the trans individuals, uh, police conducted a wellness check mm. on uh, the home of the individual. After an unidentified person called 911 to report uh, they were having a mental health crisis. So, oh, did this include that? Was this the mayor? Um, I don't, is it that person? I don't think so. Because that's what happened with the mayor of. Um, no, this isn't. With Alabama Town or right, whatever. Right. Remember right, that? Right. They were doing a wellness check on him, mm-hmm. and he got out of his car and shot himself. Yeah. Right. And in this front is of in police. Pennsylvania. Uh, aimed the gun at police, so an officer had to shoot three times. And. So it was and basically a, so suicide by to? cop. Right. So what are we down to? Like eight? Uh-huh. Yeah. Eight, maybe even seven. <sighs> well, so if, oh, if you want to give it, overdose. If you want to give it all 26 of them, mm-hmm. that is point zero 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 eight percent of the population being killed okay. this year. Well, all right. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I mean, and was... for that, we're having a, a day of remembrance. During Thanksgiving. You know, okay. yeah, during Thanksgiving, yeah. And, and we're, even with that, we're making it out to be a worse problem than it is, by far, because they weren't killed through hate crimes. Have any of them right. been killed by hate crimes? I don't know. I don't know, but we're only, we're down to eight now, yeah. maybe even seven. I lost count. Yeah. Seven or eight of them. And how many of those are suicides, I wonder? Right. So, um... Uh, have you heard, since we're Jeez. doing Transgender uh, Remembrance Day, mm-hmm. uh, belated, belated, uh, have you heard about uh, an individual named Jason Lee Willie, a biological male who identifies as Alexia in Willie? Yeah, this uh, is the serial killer? Uh, the guy who has threatened to uh, rape and right. murder Christian schoolgirls. That's girls. right. A yes. transgender guy who says that he will Gosh. blank them till they die in the bathroom and inject them with HIV. <sighs> I don't know if that's overkill. Like, yeah, he was going to inject, I believe, everybody he every Christian with a cross. The cross, yes. He was going to inject with HIV. Mm. Oh, all right. Well, that's special. Uh, what a precious man or woman, whatever they are. Whatever that person is. 
<sighs> so if he were to say try that and uh-huh. uh, um, police intervened mm. and stopped that from happening, would that be added to the list of KJP's uh, yeah transgender yes. remembrance day? Yes, you know he would be. You know that person would be. I mean that's despicable too. I you know the hatred from that person, uh, and they're pretty open about it. They pleaded innocent to the charges. By the way, they they that person was arrested and uh, is going to be charged. And this was said. These these were things said like in online chats or yeah. something. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's uh, m- making terroristic threats essentially, and so they fi- they did something about it. And there's yet another transgender person who is at least threatening to kill other people. 